Hello, sweet crew, and welcome to a new episode of Bake It! With maple syrup, this dessert is a staple where I live, but we're switching up the sweet tree nectar for a strawberry sauce. What are we making? A strawberry shomer's pudding. For this recipe, you'll need flour, baking powder, salt, butter, sugar, eggs, vanilla extract, strawberry sauce, and cream. Preheat your oven at 425 degrees Fahrenheit. In a glass or ceramic pan, pour the strawberry sauce and cream. Depending on the thickness of your strawberry sauce, you might want to add some water. This step is optional, but I like it better when it's more liquidy. I add between half a cup to a cup of water. Whisk the ingredients together and set aside. In a bowl, sift together the flour, the baking powder, and the salt. Set aside. In another bowl, cream together the butter and the sugar. Add one egg at a time and whisk the ingredients until homogeneous. Add the vanilla extract and half of the dry ingredients. Whisk. Add the remaining dry ingredients and whisk. I finish combining the ingredients by hand as I'm sure I'll get all of my dry ingredients in there. Form a ball with your dough and place it in the center of your pan. Bake in the oven for 20 minutes, then lower the temperature to 350 Fahrenheit and bake another 20 minutes or until an inserted toothpick in the center of the Shomar's pudding comes out clean. This dessert, whether the original version or its variation, is by far one of the ugliest desserts I've seen. However, like many casseroles and winter spring dishes, this is a comfort food. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. If you did, don't forget to like it and comment what you'd like to see in the next episodes of Bake It. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and share it too. Have a wonderfully sweet week.